telling you, they've come in the car, they've come in the car, right? Nobody has come through that gate yet. How much is the Stone Island? Um. How much is this? Got up for four pounds somewhere with the sticker. Don't worry. What is it? Oh, okay, okay. I see, I see. So you look it into the kitchen like a TV yes. type thing. Thank you so much anyway. Okay. Rusty, rusty. After you, mate. So obviously I spotted the retro gaming stuff and just dived straight over to the stall to see if there was any more. She actually sold this to him for four pounds. Four pounds! <laughs> Sorry, mate. How much are your bits and pieces in there? Uh, the Google, four quid. Oh, shit, I don't want to drop anything. Uh, I don't really want that one to be fair. Uh, these ones without a case. Straps. Is that a charger for the thing? No, it's not, is it? What is this? That is uh, a writing pad, isn't it? Yeah. Probably that as well. Uh, I'm, I'm being a pain, aren't I? No, you're fine. <laughs> Shit. Um, yeah, definitely those ones. Yeah. That's it, mate, if I'm honest. What do you want for that? Hello. Fine. Can't bother to argue, mate. <laughs> I appreciate it, dude. Thank you, Thank you very much. You. you look about my size-ish as well. Maybe just a bit bigger, but... <laughs> All right. Thank you, I appreciate it, guys. That geezer picked up a Game Boy Advance Clear just before I came through. Gutted. Do, 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 do. How much are you plush down here, mate? Uh, Squidder. I'll take that one for sure. Yes. Thank you very much. That's two pounds for that, please. Two for this one. Thank you very Thank much. You. Do you want to oh no, I'm okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you so Strange yeah. that was. Yeah. So I'm talking about loud. Yeah. YouTuber. Yeah. Yeah. How you doing, mate? You right? Yeah, yeah. Do you have a comment? Do I, do I speak to you? Yeah, yeah, comment now and again. Oh, cool, man. Watch, what's, the, the, what's your name on there? Uh, it's an old one, Vapor Jim. Oh, okay. Basically, I'll just, well, I just like to make sure that I'm. Not ignoring people that yeah, I talk to a lot, do you know what I mean? Because yeah. I've got a face, haven't I? But you guys haven't. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, so it's a weird one. Are, yeah. That lady there just paid one pound for one thing and then two pound for the same thing on the same stool. <laughs> hope you hope you find yeah. some stuff, mate. Thanks for coming over. Yeah, no Hello. Morning. How much is the t-shirt? Uh, they're going fifty p. You got any more football stuff, or is that it? No, that's, that's it, it. I'm afraid. So yeah, I think I still want. Of course. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm going to have a look down here. Is that alright? Yeah, of course you can. Never mind. Thanks anyway. I appreciate it. <laughs> is that a bag? It's got, yeah, I think so. It's got a zip on it and the arms do up. <laughs> How much is he? Um, Woody Woodpecker, isn't it, I think? Yeah. I'll buy him. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. <laughs> Fuck me, mate. We, we almost had, we almost had a little bit of content then. <laughs> it's an old one that is. How much is the jackets, mate? Uh, quid, quid. We've got a quid on it if that's alright. I need a little yeah, bit of a scrub. It's gonna need a bit. Thank you, mate. I appreciate that. Do you like it? Yeah, I do. You well, that's all right, then, isn't it? Time now, isn't yeah, I'm just trying to get as much out as I can at the minute. Blame you. There you go. Good there you go. You. Thank you for the deal, mate. How much is the bag? Two pounds. Yeah, we'll do that. Who said two pounds? Who am I paying? You, so. Thank you, I appreciate that. What about your clothing in these boxes? 
How much is the clothing in the boxes? Okay. Let me just have a quick little look. Okay, I just got one top down there. Oh shit, I just should on it as well. <laughs> thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Hello. Yeah, thank you. Well, someone's in trouble. These headphones in here? Uh, no, oh, just no. the empty Thanks anyway. Christmas is coming. How much are your shoes? Are they all different? Ones, yeah. These goldy colour pumas, for example. Five on, Five on them. Yeah. Alright, thank you. What size is that one? I like the style of that. Yes. Yeah. Question. I'll try them. Is that right? How much is it? How much you want that jacket, Ross? I know they're quite expensive to buy. Are they? Six quid. Six. You'll kill me. I think you have 15 there. I bought it last time. I try not to let it. I try to get rid of it. Yeah. How much are these jeans here? What the Levi's a tenner. Tenner. Would you do a five on this one? No, I think. Not. Yeah. Yeah. No worries. Thanks anyway. I do appreciate it, showing me. Dude, dude. Hello, buddy. So you think I'm crazy, but that jacket had mould. It wasn't worth trying to save. Three-person chest set. Three person chess set. Bought an antique shop in about 95. Mm. That one's box fresh. Uh, the other one's. Uh... How much is this one then? Right, well, that's the one I don't want to sell too much of, so I was oh, okay. 20 quid for it because it's pretty nice. 20. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Yeah, I don't, I don't even know three people to play with. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Do you want it? Three person chess set right up your street. Right, yeah, thank you, unusual. mate. Yeah, I appreciate it anyway. Thank you so no much. Worries, thank you. If you don't buy it, I will. <laughs> I was going to help you. <laughs> thank you. 50p on the table. Thank you very much. More your way here, mate. No, mate, I've penned myself in. <laughs> Standard. <laughs> what size is that one, mate? Can I have a look? Is that all right? Never mind, where was you going to hang it up here, I think, right? Uh, yeah, I was going to Who's got big ones? Billy's got yeah, big ones. Yeah, mate, you're getting in shape again, anyway, though. Yeah. I've done cool. <laughs> Just got a vest on today. <laughs> How's things, man? All right? Yeah, not bad. You've been keeping well, mate, yeah? I'm well, mate, yeah. Scrapping, bro. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. I'll take the hangers off if that makes your life a bit easier. How much is the Stone Island? Um, Just yeah. joking. It's all right, it's not my size. <laughs> Wind me up there, wouldn't you? <laughs> 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 I thought I was slipping. Oh, don't worry. I'll leave you to the box. I'll catch up with you, Bill, man. How much is your clothing up here? Or is it all different? So as soon as you get to where your hand is, the rest is a fiver down, and before your hand on our side, it's a tenner apart. Gotcha. Last jacket is 30. Just because it's really expensive. Yeah, it's tiny for me, that one, though. Yeah. Thank you so much. The rain is coming, which means Ricky is going. Let's see what you've put out now you set up. <laughs> You're ruggers, are you? Yeah. Anyway, Cornish. One more night, one more night. Thanks, mate. Your time is very precious. You've spent enough time watching me wander around the car boot cell. So let's just dive straight into it.
This was the first pickup and it's a bundle deal and I paid £10 for it all. But what I'm hoping the camera picked up, I haven't seen the footage yet. I was 13 seconds behind a guy that picked up a clear GBA, Game Boy Advance. So obviously I was interested in the stall, dove straight in and saw this and was like, whoa! Started picking up all the UMD discs, not even looking at them. I was like, yes, boss! Put a load of stuff together. How much? £10. So I'll show you what I got for £10. Google Nest. That was the reason why I paid £10 for it all. Because I know I'm going to get my money back just on that. They sell for £10, £12, £15, depending on the day and the buyer. With that came this Huon, Hoyon, however you want to say it, graphics drawing pad. 10 to 15 back on that. A couple of genuine Apple straps. These sell quite well. These ones, Jess has already confirmed. Unfortunately, nothing exciting. But all part of the bundle, I'll get some money back on them, won't I? And these discs, now I didn't even look, well, I saw that and just started grabbing UMDs because everyone else started swarming at this point. Uh, we've got the Lemmings for the PSP and then we've got DVDs. I don't give a shit about DVDs. We've got the Mighty Boosh, although that is really, really good. I love the Mighty Boosh. I'm the moon. My friend Jupiter is going to smash you. The Mighty Boosh 2. I think that's Liar Liar or Bruce Almighty and then Futurama, but who cares? So I paid £10 for that bundle. It's not as good as I thought, but it's okay. Ladies, Tommy Bahama dress thing. Really sort of nice. Cool. It's, like a, it's like an automatic cooling system material. It's not spandex, but it just feels really nice and cool on the hands. Uh, Tommy Bahama paid £1. 50 pence paid on this, what I believe to be 21 to 22 Chelsea football top. Haven't looked into it fully yet. Obviously, the sponsor has a bit of wear and there is some like wear on the back there. I don't even know if Mount is a real person. If he's not, then that's just a person and I've lost 50 whole pence. But I don't mind spending 50p to do the research later at all. But if that was in great condition and if that's a player or not, you're looking at about 25 to £35 pound from my research so far. You might have seen this on the camera, but... And obviously, I wasn't going to argue and say, well, your daughter's just basically, look, I paid £1 for a jelly cat avocado, genuine, real jelly cat avocado. And then I was walking through her stall and I saw the mum and there was another one. I said, oh, how much is that? She had £2. I thought, whatever, I'm getting a good deal. Who cares? Obviously, people are going absolutely mental for these jelly cat avocados at the moment. This one has had the back end of the tags cut out. This one, they still remain, but it shouldn't affect the value too much. I'm seeing these go for anywhere up to £60 with the teal hat, teal beanie, teal cosy, whatever you want to say it. Average price is between 28 to 40 I've got two of them. So an average, so I paid £1.50 each, basically, but I quite like them. I think they're really cute. Might just make them my little uh, video buddies in future. What do you reckon? If they're going to stay there, they'll stay if I do the Viking pose from Kin. By the way, whoever that was, he does this. <clears throat> Whoever that was that recommended me to watch Kin, really appreciate you. I just finished it yesterday. Fantastic. This was really, really smart. I, I filled it up just to try and puff it out for the video. But £2 for this Tommy Hilfiger Italia duffel bag. Remarkable condition. Fantastic condition, actually. Two quid. I'm hoping 25 to £40 back on that. I might use it myself for a bit. Now this. <laughs> that was really bad. Woody Woodpecker. This is from, I think it was from a resort. Can't remember, but apparently they're being sold. At, they were sold at resorts. Can you guess what it is? I'll show you. Now, unfortunately, he is missing. Oh, well, I hope we're not showing too much there. There is an extension piece that goes in between, but unfortunately, I don't have that. However, luckily, it fits me. It's a bum bag. There's your stuff, you put your stuff in there, you zip up, and you've got Woody Woodpecker hugging you while you go on all the rides and whatever else you're doing. I really like it. I paid £2, I think, for the pleasure of owning and possibly selling him, which I think was quite a good price. And this is a 1980s Henry Lloyd Parker jacket. Oh, 1980s by nylon Parker jacket. I'm trying to flatten the tags down. I'm not trying to hide anything, I'm trying to flatten the tags down. Now it has got a bit of use to it. There's a few marks and stuff, and it is missing the fur for the parker, of course. But it's old. What do we expect for this kind of age? 1980. It's not in the worst condition at all. You can look through the if you look through here, 
Oh, you probably can't see it on there. Let me hold it. Maybe if I hold it up to there. Basically, some of the liner has started to like fade through. There you go. You can see these little patches around here where the area has started to wear thin, but you can't actually see it on the jacket on the back. Just wear some of the layer between the outer and the inner padding, which is a like the quilted pattern has just started to come away. But it's an old one. It is missing the fur. I've only, I've only, oh. I've only seen the blue ones listed for about 65 quid and in worse condition than that. So I don't really know, but I'm, I'm, I paid a pound for it. I paid, I paid a quid. We can't care at a quid, can we? I've got family over, so I need to go. I've just filmed three haul videos. So I massively appreciate you watching. I love you all, and I'll see you on the next one. DVDs though.